राय रेरा रियल इस्टेट रेगुलेशन एंड डेवलपमेंट एक्ट टू थाउजेंड सिक्सटीन विच वॉज नोटिफाइड ऑन फर्स्ट ऑफ मे टू थाउजेंड सेवनटीन वी आर मेकिंग सीरीज ऑफ वीडियो ऑन रेरा विच विल कवर एंटायर एक्ट ऑफ रेरा इट कुड बी अराउंड फिफ्टीन टू ट्वेंटी वीडियोज इन दैट वी आर ऑलरेडी मेड वन वीडियो ऑन रेरा कन्वेन्स अंडर द रेरा and in that i had specifically told that rera contemplates that conveyance of the flat has to be given to the flat purchaser so today this video is on conveyance of the flat to the flat purchaser my name is girish rao i am advocate and solicitor i have more than 27 years of experience and i have registered more than 100 projects under the rera and this video is brought to you by legal scholar academy legal scholar academy conduct various courses on law like master in drafting of agreement master in drafting of pleading master in rera and many other courses if you want to know more about it you can connect with them on the number which is scrolling down here right and in addition to that on every friday at 7:30 pm legal scholar academy also conduct free webinar on different topics of law if you want to join those webinar you can connect with them on the number which is scrolling down here right so let's start with our today's topic today's topic before we start our today's topic it's request to everyone to subscribe to the channel once you subscribe to the channel you will get notification as and when we post a video and all the videos are very informative and you will get lot of knowledge in that so i will request all of you to subscribe it and don't forget to press a like button because i am sure you are going to like it okay so now let's start what are the relevant provision due to which according to me the flat has to be conveyed to the flat purchaser let's see first is section 11 sub section 4 sub section a of that promoter shall be responsible for all obligation responsibilities and function under the provision of this act or the rules and regulation made there under or to the allottee as per the agreement for sale or to the association of allottees as the case may be till the conveyance of all the apartments plots or building as the case may be to the allottees or the common areas to the association of the allottees or the competent authority as case may be so this section clearly contemplates that conveyance of the all apartments to who it has to be to the allottees or common area to the association of the allottees so flat has to be allotted or sorry conveyed to the allottees and common area has to be conveyed to the association of allottee let's go further now same sex same subsection 4 of section 11 f shall be what is the word promoter shall execute a registered conveyance deed of apartment again it is coming apartment plot or building as the case may be in favor of allottee conveyance again it is saying is in favor of allottee along with undivided proportionate title in the common area so in common area a flat purchaser will have a undivided proportionate title in association of uh, common area to the association of allotty or the competent authority as case may be as prescribed under section 17 of the act so now let's read section 17 of that transfer of title section 17 promoter shall execute registered conveyance deed in favor of allottee along with undivided proportionate title in the common area 
to the association of the allottee. So here again, very clearly it states, register conveying deed to the allottee along with common, along with undivided proportionate title in the common area. I will read again. Conveyance deed in favor of allottee along with the undivided proportionate title in the common area to the association of the allottee or the competent authority as case, case may be and hand over physical possession of the flat apartment of the building as the case may be to the allottee. So what will happen? Physical possession of the apartment should be handed over to the allottee and common area to the association of the allottee or the competent authority as the case may be in the real estate project. So what has to be done? Physical possession of the common area should be handed over to the association of the allottee and the apartment should be handed over to the flat purchaser. And other title documents per pertaining that to within a specified period as per sanctioned plan as provided under the local law. Then proviso. Provided that in absence of any local law, conveyance deed in favor of allottee. Again, it's very clear say allottee or the association allottee or the competent authority as the case may be under this section shall be carried out by the promoter within three months from the date of issue of occupation certificate. Now, this talks about the period within which the conveyance should be done. It says in absence of local law, it has to be done within three months. But you are aware that under the MOFA, it has to be done within a period of four months from the registration of the society. But then that conveyance is of entire land on which the project is. So when we talk about RERA, RERA very specifically and clearly tell that conveyance deed has to be of the particular plot to the flat purchaser. That's what specifically says. And in addition to that, one of the requirement is that under section 4, when you make an application for registration, the one of the requirement is that you have to submit a pro forma of conveyance deed proposed and signed by the allottee, proposed to be signed by the allottee. So in all provision, it very clearly contemplates that there should be uh, there should be a conveyance of the flat. And in addition to that, one more provision, what is the responsibility of allottee? Section 19 deals with that. Section uh, Subsection 11 of, sec subse uh, of section 19. Every allottee shall participate towards registration of conveyance deed of the apartment plot or the building as case, case may be as provided under subsection 1 of section 17 of the act. So here again very clearly states that the conveyance has to be that of flat to the flat purchaser. Even similar provision is there in the MOFA also. Let's go through that now. Yeah. When you talk about MOFA, it doesn't say that conveyance has to be to the flat purchaser. MUFA contemplates that property has to be conveyed to the society. But if you see the section 4 of the MUFA, you will see that agreement has to, de has to define the percentage of undivided interest in the common area under section 4. Section 4 is that promoter before, I am reading now MOFA, promoter before accepting advance payment or deposit to enter into agreement and agreement to be registered. In that section, one subsection 1A one of that talks about what should agreement contain. The agreement to be in the prescribed and and subsection 1 shall contain inter alia 
the particulars as specified in the clause a and to such agreement there shall be attached the copies copies of documents specified in the clause b so what that particulars which talks about that in the in the section uh, subsection a is about the percentage of undivided interest in the common area subsection in that uh, roman 7 8 sorry percentage of undivided interest in the common area and facilities pertaining to the flat agreed to be sale, sold again 10 percentage of undivided interest in the limited common area so again if you see in the mofa also talks about undivided interest in the common area of the flat purchaser so now when we read it together I, rera rera without any doubt is very clear that conveyance has to be that of flat to the flat purchaser but at present maharera is not doing it i think that's wrong of course, then there should have been some provision like now, now changes which are being made in the Maharashtra Apartment Ownership Act that tomorrow means few years down the line, if you have to do the redevelopment of the property, then it could be done by the majority decision. And all those things provision, even recent, I think if it's few days back, two, three days back also further, allora, further amendment they have done in the Maharashtra Apartment Ownership Act. So similar provision will have to be added into the RERA. But RERA as such stand today is very clear that flat has to be conveyed to the flat purchaser and that is there is no, no doubt about this interpretation. If you have something different thought on this, certainly put in the comment. I would like to know that what is this uh, you have thought about. So thank you for watching this video. This is a brief presentation which I wanted to make make on the topic of conveyance of the flat to the flat purchaser. Thank you. I request all of you again to subscribe to this channel. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit that like button. Bye-bye. Take care.